Hello, my beautiful Capricorns. Thank you so much for coming to my channel and checking me out. This is going to be who uh, spy on you. This is going to be for um, singles, couples, or anyone in between or anyone who needs love messages for March 2019. Okay, so thank you guys so much for liking and subscribing to my channel. I really appreciate it. All right, so let's jump right in. Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign. Tell me what their love interest secretly wants to tell them for March 2018. Show me the cards I need to see. Show me the cards I need to see. Okay, let's jump in. So, uh, Three of Wands shows me someone's waiting for their ships to come in. Knight of Cups says some kind of movement in love. So, someone's waiting for something to move in love. Okay. Five of Pentacles says someone's left out in the cold. Feeling left out in the cold. Mm, seven of swords some kind of sneaky behavior okay guys remember these are uh, general love messages so this doesn't resonate with you um, you can always get a personal reading with me by going to my website jenniferwalkerzen.com or checking out the link below okay so let's get started so three of wands what does that say it says someone's waiting for the ships to come in uh before they do some kind of movement in love because of being left out in the cold due to some kind of sneaky behavior so that's what they secretly want to tell you so let's clarify that and get some more information i'm going to use the lenormand deck for the clarification here and i'm using the golden tarot uh, for the uh, tarot so let's see what is this three of wands about mm. three of wands something to do with snake so snake has to do with Someone who's been backbiting, think about a snake. What is the snake's behavior? Um, could be some kind of sexual situation with the snake. Okay, so something's waiting. They're waiting for the ships to come in. Uh, this also could be a female, by the way. <laughs> Interesting enough. <laughs> uh, possibly a female as well. So, um, something to do with the Knight of Cups. Why is the Knight of Cups here? 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 Okay, so movement of love seems to be a burden of some sort. Okay. And why is the Five of Coins here? 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 So feeling left out in the cold because maybe they offered you or offered somebody a gift. Okay, so this is a gift of some sort, a solid, tangible gift. Okay. Um, or somebody offered someone a, a solid, tangible gift and left them out in the cold. All right, why is the Seven of Swords here? Why is the Seven of Swords here? Why is the Seven of Swords here? Okay. Due to messages. Mm, messages, good news messages. All right. Let's kind of take a look at this here. Okay, so some kind of sneaky behavior, some kind of deception was going on. With this person that secretly want to tell you that they've been waiting maybe they've been kind of sneaking around here with the snake card sneaking around and uh, maybe doing some backbiting here um, when it comes to some kind of movement of love that they feel is a burden uh, because they've been left out in the cold maybe someone got engaged here because um, that also could be the flowers because there was some kind of great message that happened but this person uh, feels like something deceptive happened surrounding this message, actually, and felt left out in the cold. All right, so let's get some more information. All right, so for Capricorn, Summon Rising, and Venus sign, what is the action their love interest is going to take towards them for March 2019 romantically? Show me the card I need to see. Show me the card I need to see. Hmm. They will have some kind of communication with you guys. Eight of Wands. Something fast moving. Maybe text message. Uh, something text message via Facebook text message or some kind of phone call here. Okay, so let's get some information on that. What's this, what's this Eight of Wands about? 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 Hmm. It's going to be about something being taken away with the mice okay so the action is going to be some kind of message but the message is going to be pertaining to something being taken away okay hmm interesting right, let's get some more information here um capricorn summoner is a venus sign 
Tell me the outcome between these two for the romantic love life for March 2019. Show me the cards I need to see. Show me the card I need to see. Show me the card I need to see. Oh, death card. Some kind of ending here. Hmm. Pertaining to a fire sign person. Sagittarius Leo Aries. Huh. So you're going to hear some kind of news about something being taken away. What this is, is something to do with an ending pertaining to a fire sign person. And I'm seeing again another female. So for this reading, it's definitely either going to be a female, female situation or a female, male situation. Okay. Um, that's interesting. So you're going to hear some kind of news about an ending of something to do with a, another person. Sagittarius, Leo, or Aries. And the snake also does represent something to do with a person, possibly, okay, female person. All right, so let's get a card on this. Why is the death card here in the Queen of Wands, please? Why is the death card here in the Queen of Wands, please? Show me the card I need to see. Show me the card I need to see. Something to do with a garden. So this message that you receive from this person, huh? So they're going to give you a message about something being taken away. All right, some some kind of ending happening here uh, in their in their love life, and uh, this could take place after after you guys. The outcome can take place, or the outcome between this situation could take place maybe at a bar, at a restaurant, at a party around friends possibly with a garden card okay let's get some advice for you guys so can i have some advice for capricorn sun moon rising and venus sign for the romantic love life for the situation what's some advice for capricorn sun moon rising and venus sign show me the card i need to see show me the card i need to see show me the card i need to see okay so the advice being some kind of unrequited love there's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going Hmm. Let me get a card on that. So that's your advice. Something to do with unrequited love. Why is unrequited love here, please? Show me the card I need to see. Show me the card I need to see. Show me the card I need to see. Something to do with a wish. A wish, a hope, or a networking. Okay, so this ending could also be because of you. Maybe you're dealing with a fire sign person. Maybe your love interest is a fire sign person and you decide to end this. Okay, and the communication you guys have together maybe uh, is about the fact that you want to be done with this because you don't have unrequited, you have unrequited love for this person and you have a wish for someone else, possibly. Or the star card also can represent the internet. So um, maybe you have unrequited love because this is an internet type of relationship, okay? Because the, the, the star card does represent the internet getting out there, networking, you know, being exposed. So this represents the internet. So something to do with unrequited love on the internet. Uh, and it looks to me like is an ending because something to do with a garden, because something to do with a lot of people, or maybe something to do with some kind of uh, celebration that you were at. But I think that you decided just to end this, to just not deal with this person anymore. Ooh, okay, Capricorn, if you want to tell me about your situation below, I'd be interested to find out what's going on here. Um, very complex situation. It's been a while since you guys had such a complex situation. Um, hmm. This little backbiting thing with this female, waiting for your ships to come in uh, type of thing, and then some kind of ending with a fire sign person who potentially is a female. Okay, um... Okay, guys, if you like this, please like and subscribe. If you want some more information on your own situation, this doesn't resonate with you. You can always get a personal reading with me by going to my website, jenniferwalkerisden.com, or checking out the link below. Thank you guys so much.